ले नहीं देगा What's up, guys? What's going on? Welcome back. It's been uh, three weeks. You know, as I said, as I stated uh, before, this house should be done in three weeks uh, from I originally made the first video. So uh, it's three weeks later and uh, just pulled up. I actually just missed the turn because I haven't been here since three weeks. So this is my sec second time actually coming here. So, uh, yeah, I mean, Let's check it out, in and out. And there's actually a secret room. Well, it's not a secret, it was a secret to me. It's a secret room that I missed on the first time that I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna show myself as well. That is upstairs. We never went upstairs the first time. So uh, let's go check it out. All right, guys, so you can see, you know, at first glance, unlike before, the landscaping was extremely tall uh, last time and it wasn't cut. So, you know, you couldn't really see where the front of the house was, but that's the front of the house. That's the side of the house there. And you can really see how this place cleaned up a lot since the last time I was here. So. Let's actually, you know, go around the property. Go around the front here. And you can see that upstairs window right there, that upstairs room that I told you about that I missed last time. So here we go. It's the front of the house. That's the side over over there to the right not be walking through these bushes well, let's try to go around the, the entire house right. landscape is all cut it's all nice so you know water runoff it's nice that it's on the top of the hill so water runoff runs right down the hill the house is on two acres well just under two acres you know you can see it goes deep in there I'm not going in there right now, but it goes deep in there. It is on two acres going around. So, you know, just come on the outside. Everything is clean, nice out here. You can see the like, little trail right here going deeper in. You could actually cut back some of these bushes and actually have a lot more yard if you chose to what really matters that it works this is the back all cleaned up all nice there you go these you seen it Then we come around. And here we are at the side. This is the side back. So let's go inside. Got some garbage cans, recycle everything that comes with it. Got the lock box here. Can't show you guys my code. All right, we got the keys. Big tall living room. Looks like it's about 14 feet in here. All right, guys. So, you know, you're walking through the back door. This is that tall living room ceiling from before. Garage. 
coming through this room. So this is the kitchen. This is the kitchen area. Whole thing getting painted. Ceilings getting let's go into the kitchen. First we make this left. So this will be the kitchenette area here. Just gotta get the light fixtures in into the house. The light fixtures and the vent covers, but everything's all painted. This is a complete kitchen. Uh, you know, the guys changed all the outlets, all brand new outlets and uh, switches all throughout the house. We got that uh, granite countertops. It looks really nice. Painted all the cabinets. Come through here. This is the garage. Big two door garage. This is all painted, all finished. Brand new LiftMaster. Guess we'll leave this washer and dryer for whoever comes here. But uh, we're gonna just get a, gonna get a dishwasher in there. So come around, once again, back in the living room. That's the front door there. Got this little like office nook section right there. This is like a little mud closet. As you come through the front door, which is right here. Front door with the glass storm door. Fireplace. This fireplace right there for you. Come around. This is the master bedroom with the vaulted ceiling there. Master closet. Nice and spacious. Bathroom. Just got to be cleaned up. Get the light fixture on there and then put a mirror. Come around. This is the main bathroom. Once again, just gotta get all the light fixtures in the house. Otherwise, it's all good. Get behind all the closets this time. So this is the little linen closet inside the bathroom. Come around, this is the third, this is the second bedroom. Second bedroom. View outside to the front. Come around, this is the third bedroom. And they all got vaulted ceilings. I gotta finish get the thermostat on here and a couple more fixtures. But yeah guys, like I said last time I missed the other room which is through this door which is right by the kitchen right here. So open that up and it's a whole another room go upstairs and this is a actually a really big room so this is like a nice loft style room you can see down see the whole driveway there back there and then it also has a big closet there. Of 
And the whole HVAC setup is right here through the closet, which makes it very accessible. So yeah, this is a nice big space. I actually like this room. Lots of storage behind that door here as well. You got a little bit of storage there. You got storage there. You got storage there. You got this big open room. Really nice. So let's go back downstairs. All right guys, so there you have it. Finally saw the entire house. As you can see, there's just a couple little things, you know, a couple um, more outlets, uh, which, you know, all the outlets, switches and everything are right here. There's so many in this house, so there's been a couple dozen already changed and there's a, a few more to go. And then all the light fixtures, got all the light fixtures on order. Uh, you know, that should be here in the next day or two. And then uh, all the light fixtures will be in and then the vent covers for the HVAC. And as you can see, this house is done. You know, three weeks later, this house is done. And, um, you know, it will be up on the market. It should be up on the market by like next week. And, um, you know, this house is not gonna last long. Not in this area. You know, gave you a little drive through into the neighborhood. You can see that, you know, it's a packed neighborhood, like there's houses all over. And the beauty about this house is it's not in an HOA and it's right off the main road. It's about a about an eighth of a mile off the main road, which is great because it's just you and one other neighbor uh, right here in this nook. And like I said, you have that extra two acres, you, you know, it's, the house is sitting on two acres, a little under two acres complete. So... You could push back some of the bush if you wanted to push back some and open up the land space a lot more. That way you have a lot more space to do whatever that you want to do. Uh, you know, there's lots of uh, options with a property like this. But yeah, guys, finally, I got to see upstairs. You got to see upstairs. So it's not a three bedroom. This is a four bedroom house, which is really cool, really dope. And uh yeah, you know, let me know what you think in the comments, you know, let me know what you think of the house uh, or whatever. Uh, and, you know, let me know if this is something you're interested in, the house or the flipping or whatever. You know, drop your comments down below, you know, hit the like. If you like this kind of stuff, you know, give us subscribe. Uh, I always have property stuff going on a lot here. That's one of my main jobs. Um, amongst a couple others but uh yeah guys thanks for watching see you on the next one peace